Right, the next race is a three horse handicap for me, Armouth. Uh, one mile five, nought to eighty handicap for three horses and up. One is Jack Cherry, Stu Gray, Ballerina Queen, Martin Needham, and I score all Obi Wan. Those are the three horses. And the favourite is Jack Cherry for Stu Gray, who's won a couple of races already. And they, as the leader starting stalls, is Jack Cherry, who goes to the front from Ballerina Queen on his outside, but just on the inside of those is Ask Coral, who goes to pick it up as they pass the winning pass for the first time and head off on their final circuit. And it's Ask Coral who leads for Obi Wan. From in second, we have Ballerina Queen, Jack Cherry just behind that. So is the only horse that's not a grey in the field, Ask Coral? He's a comfortable leader for Obi Wan, from in second uh, Ballerina Queen for Martin Needham, and the favourite Jack Cherry looking on from the rear, about four lengths off this leader, Ask Coral. So Ask Coral takes him along in the rain, travelling comfortably, about two lengths clear of Ballerina Queen in second, and Jack Cherry looks on from the rear, about five lengths off this leader, Ask Coral. So it's Obi Wan, who's Ask Coral leads from Martin Needham's Ballerina Queen. The first of the greys and the second of the greys in those black colours is Jack Cherry for Stu Gray. Those are the three runners. They've got about a mile left to go. And it's Ask Coral is a comfortable leader from Ballerina Queen in second with Jack Cherry behind that. There's about five lengths first to last here as Ask Coral takes him along in the rain for Obi Wan in those yellow colours. The purple lilac and white stripes of the first of the greys is Martin Needham's Ballerina Queen, is about two lengths adrift of Ask Coral, and the favourite at the back of the field, the second of the greys, and the black colours is Stu Grey's Jack Cherry. So Ask Coral, the outside of the party, leads from Ballerina Queen in second. Jack Cherry is creeping closer, um, it's just got to within about three lengths off this leader. It's Ask Coral still leads, but he's only about a length and a half clear of Ballerina Queen in second. Jack Cherry's also moved closer, and he's about three lengths first to last year, as Ask Coral now tries to kick from the front as they approach the, the turn to the home straight. It's Ask Coral who's clear from Ballerina Queen. Jack Cherry moving closer for Stu Gray, but it's still Ask Coral in front. Ballerina Queen now has Jack Cherry on his outside, and the favourite is moving closer. It's Ask Coral who still leads from Ballerina Queen and Jack Cherry. They've got about three furlongs left to travel. There's still Ask Coral is clear. I, if anything, Ask Coral is extended a bit. It's gone about uh, two, three lengths clear. It's dictated from the front, and Ask Coral is still travelling strongly in front. But here comes Ballerina Queen and Jack Cherry. It's Ask Coral who's now starting to get wary. Here comes Ballerina Queen, Jack Cherry on his outside. And Jack Cherry, who's won multiple times this season, is moving up strongly on the outside of Ask Coral. It's still Ask Coral, but Jack Cherry is coming to grab Ask Coral close to the pony post and Jack Cherry draws clear from Ballerina Queen and Jack Cherry the favourite's going to oblige you We're running one in away from this field Jack Cherry's going to win comfortably from Ballerina Queen in second Ask Coral has nothing more to offer back in third but Stu Gray picks up another winner Jack Cherry multiple winner of the season wins another one yeah at Yarmouth Jack Cherry wins comfortably by about two lengths from Ballerina Queen in second Ask Coral the long time leader finished back in third for Obi-Wan